thought, and the me lips. too. That's how come I said I was picturing my lip hanging up in the The big dogs, are you supposed to tip them? Woo! Kids or anything. Y'all probably know more about my kids than my own damn mama know. That's how personal I am with y'all. What's up, y'all? Today is officially Carla's birthday. What's up, y'all? I'm trying to make it to my appointment. All right, tell them what you're getting done. Well, what's what's the day looking like? All right, y'all. So today I am headed to. You know how to get there? Uh, actually, I don't. I know you're gonna go to that traffic light and make a right. All right, y'all. So I am headed to um, get my first wax, y'all. <laughs> so um, it's crazy because. Uh, my daughter, she has done this before, but I haven't. So I was telling her I was having like these thoughts. And um, I'm going to show y'all like our text message thread. Because I know my daughter was just like, I said for real, it was one of them texts where she was like, text him with my mom be like this. <laughs> so either way, uh, I am nervous. And I'm trying not to be nervous, but um, I'll let y'all know how it go. All right, and when she say wax, she's saying a Brazilian wax, right? Yes. So yeah, she getting, when she says she getting her coochie snatched, she's literally about to get it snatched. <laughs> <laughs> yes, y'all. So um, I know some people gonna be like, oh, Carly, it ain't that deep, girl. Just go get in there, it ain't gonna be that bad. But my daughter already then um, gave me, she didn't already say, it's this one part that's going to hurt. She said, I ain't going to even lie to you. <laughs> I think I have an idea. And for when her. she told me, I said, I'm just literally thinking about my coochie lip going to be <laughs> up in the air. <laughs> so, um. And I told Carla, I said, you better not come back with only one, uh, <laughs> one strike or one strip in your, uh. You know, your hoo-ha. <laughs> yeah, because um, my daughter told me, she said, if you don't like it, you know you can stop at any time. You don't have to go through with it if it's too painful. So I said, well, honey, I said, mean, the type of person I am, I said, once I started, it, it's like I'm going to finish it. It's like I might be in pain. And I might, you know, I'll let y'all know what it is at the end. I was like, but I'm gonna finish it. I said, but I said, what would they do? Be like, okay, ma'am, we not gonna charge you. And she said, I don't know. She said, it probably just depends on how far they get into the process. So I was just like, honey, there was something else that made me nervous. Yeah. Tell me some, you can stop. And obviously, Carla got some nerves because she been having nightmares and all type. It's either. It's either Carla been nervous about this uh, coochie wax she about to get, or Carla has made the decision to wrap us in that bed like burritos. Yes, y'all, because Nick love messing up the freaking bed. Like, y'all, when I tell y'all the sheets just, I be wondering why is my feet hanging out. And it had everything to do with my wife. So, Carla has, like, d deeply, like, slipped the covers under the mattress. So, it's, like, hard to get out of them when I'm asleep. Because I do it in my sleep. Like, I, my leg come out if I get too high. You know, the regulator. And uh, this time, even I had nightmares. You know, being just trapped, like, in the covers like that. Yeah, I felt like I was trapped. So, you know, Carla. <laughs> I was like, girl, I don't know if it's. You know, the fact that I hadn't been getting proper rest or what. I was like, but I've been having crazy dreams. And usually, y'all, I can't even remember my dreams. I done had three crazy dreams. I had to wake Carla out of her sleep in one of them. Because she yes. was like. Uh, and every hate. time she do that, y'all, tell me why she fighting in her dream. Yeah. I was mad. But you know them dreams, they be playing your ass because sometimes you be trying to hit somebody and yes. you be slow motion. Or you or... be trying to cuss they ass yeah. out. Yeah, and the words and they it's come like, out your mouth. You be they're like, not, the words are not what you want to say is not coming out. <laughs> Let me find out your dream censored. Honey, it's like I just 
what I wanted to say was not coming out. So then I wanted to fight and it was making me mad. You either be punching through the body <laughs> or it's like you can't seem to get to them. Yeah. The jury's be playing us. Alright y'all, I gotta go. I can't, I, it be hard for me to talk on the camera y'all when I'm nervous or I'm in the midst of something. So I'm gonna get this to Nick. All right, y'all, so it looked like um, Carla's done. I see her over there talking uh, to the receptionist. We're gonna see how it went for her. She having some good conversation, boy. Come on, look, Carla. <laughs> Just letting her know that I'm here. Yep, yep, y'all. So, um, today is all going to be all about Carla. Like, her love languages are acts of services and uh, quality time. So, we're going to, of course, spend plenty of quality time together. We're going to go to her favorite, well, her favorite restaurant at this time. Um, going to have some good drinks. Um, got her favorite desserts that she's been asking for. Um, I gotta go and pick that up later, and then she's getting, like, massages and facials. Y'all know she loves, like, grooming herself. So today is just any way that I can make this special and, um, all about her, then, um, then that is what's gonna happen. So, uh, yeah. I even got up this morning and was like, I, I just wanna drive, drive her around. I don't even want her to have to drive. That's kind of like acts of services in, in, in a way, if you think of it, because... It's like something like I'll drive, but I don't really like to, I don't really feel like driving. Or I, It's like I'll drive, but and I would prefer not to. So it's like acts of service is kind of like, babe, I'll sh chauffeur you all day. Like I'm, I'm going to drive you around all day and all the shit that she, you know, get into today. I have a few things going on around Huntsville. I was trying to think about getting into. She said she don't really want to do too much when it comes to activities. Um, so I kept that in mind. So. Y'all, whatever we could do to make this special. I, I ain't gonna, uh, I'm going to um, let y'all know this now. Like when Carla was seeing all the love come through on all of her social media platforms, like her eyes was watering up. She said she don't even know if she could talk about it the way she want because she may cry. Oh, they gave her a gift for her birthday. Um, Just, you know, just all the love she received. So y'all, thank y'all so much for just sending just all the love. The birthday wishes, everything. Hitting our cash app and Venmo. Thank you so freaking much. It just makes her feel just so special. And she's such a sweetheart. She deserves all of it. Alright, y'all. Let's see how she walking. Make sure she ain't walking with no limp. <laughs> she almost like her eyes was watered up. Oh shit, hold up. It's low. Okay, there you go. Let me in, young blood. <laughs> Alright, go, young blood. You know, it was it was straight. Why your eyes are like you've been crying? Huh? Your eyes are like you've been crying. You no, they crying. don't. <laughs> they do not. No, I ain't been crying. <laughs> so, um, how did it go, honey? Oh, did you want to get her to get ready to go um shopping? Time to do your shopping spree? Uh I guess we could go to, yeah, I guess so. Come on, girl. Yeah, but y'all, it wasn't bad. Um, okay, so let me explain this. So, so you, you know when you go and you get a piercing, right? Yes. And they be like, um, they be like, breathe in. Uh-huh. And then they be like, it's, that he ain't even yes, stop. after that. Regular truck. I ain't even want to say that. Yeah, he's too out. Okay, he's just Look, keep, keep your head in front of you. Cause yeah, that motherfucker.
was so out. So, um, either way, she was like, breathe in. Oh, I don't even have, see, see what I'm saying? <laughs> We're going to go to Coles, right? Yeah. And then um, when she said exhale, I thought that's when she was going to do it. And then she was like, breathe in again for me. And I'm breathing in, thinking I'm finna exhale, honey. That's when she pulled with it. And I was just like, okay. Okay. <laughs> this is what we working with. But I was never, it's right up here. If you leave, um, if you leave out, you may not want to leave out right here because I think that's going to send you going back to the right. Yeah, that's why I was trying mistaken. to pull up on the GPS. So here, go back out by KFC. Girl, okay. So, how, like, can you describe the type of pain it was or... Cause you know if you try to have you ever tried to tweet your hair out of your hoo ha? Yeah, it feels like that. Oh my goodness, that is like one of the worst pains. Like that, like you know when you pull hair out your chin or you pull hair out your um. Have you ever? Well, no, you've never gotten your eyebrows waxed. But see, I've got my no, I've eyebrows waxed wax before. Okay. So um, I was familiar with it. You gonna go over okay. that way? Gotcha. Cause that's gonna make you go back to um right. Okay. So, um, yeah, I was like, okay, and so, and the lady at the counter, remember she said the first time is the hardest. Yeah. So, I was like, okay, so this is how committed I am. Okay. I've already set up my next appointment. Okay. And actually, I've already set up my next 12. Oh, damn. Y'all see how spoiled she is? My baby <laughs> just do whatever she wants. Yeah, I was just sitting up here talking to Nick. I thought I had got off the phone with my daughter. My daughter had called to tell me happy birthday. And then I told her, I said, girl, I just left my wax, girl, and I'm still alive. <laughs> <laughs> it made me think about Olivia on the Cosby show. Uh -huh. Remember when she ate Denise's food for the first time? Yeah. And she said, I'm still alive. <laughs> so um, I told Nick, I said, um, when she first tried to do it, though, y'all, it was like, <sighs> let me see how to explain this. So, to have wax on you, and it was a hard wax. So, it's like they just put the wax on and they pull the wax. Honey, when she tried to pull it, it wouldn't come off. And it made me think about them people on YouTube who was doing that um, wax challenge. And I was just like, oh, fuck. Y'all, and it was like down on my lip. Oh my so goodness. she was trying to grip it from the bottom, mm -hmm. trying to pull it up. And I was just like, why this shit ain't coming off? I'm like, what's happening? So then she was like, it's okay. <laughs> you know, she was like trying to keep me calm. And she was like, did you have the heat on like when you drove here? And I was like, no, I couldn't remember if we had the heat no, on. We and I told her, I said, I don't think so. I was like, but I was moving around a lot. So what she was saying is because my body was hot, mm -hmm. I guess... It was having a, it was like reacting to the wax. So y'all, when she finally got their wax to come off, I was like, Ugh. yeah. And so she was like, after she, you know, was almost finished with the wax, actually when she got over to the second part, she said, this is the hardest part. So that's why. It's like the part that she was doing, that was the hardest part. And that was the part that my daughter had told me about. But I thought they were going to do it different. Mm -hmm. So she was saying, it was, my daughter explained it. She said, you know the part right before your lips start. So you know it's like that little circle part like right before your clitoris. Yeah. So I thought she was talking about that. Are you talking about the top? Yeah. I thought that's what Sierra was saying when she explained it. Mm. So, but what's the hardest part, though? To me, it's actually the coochie lip. Yes, that's what I would think would be the my entire time. That's what's the hardest part that I was thinking about. So, lips. and the me lips. too. That's how come I said I was picturing my <laughs> lip hanging up in. The <laughs> Was it?
<laughs> so was that the hardest part? That was the hardest part. Exactly. So like when she was doing so, Sierra might just be sensitive in a different area uh-huh. for me. <laughs> but I don't know why I was not expecting like y'all. I was not expecting pain on the first pool. So I was just like, because I was thinking like, okay, this ain't the area Sierra said. So, y'all, when she went to, and then it was like her hand slipped off their wax. And I was like, oop. I had actually made that noise. I said, oop. And she said, just relax. (laughs) And then she was fanning the wax. She was fanning, I guess, from my body, my, my body being hot, the wax being hot. And then finally the air kicked on. And I was like, okay. Like, I was hot because the wax is literally, it's, it's warm, you know? So it's like, when you put some warm on your body, your body temperature is going to raise. And if I was already hot, so then it was like, when the air kicked on, it was just like, it was easy, but still, yeah, like, both of, both of my, um, yeah, my lips. They still there, though, y'all. Yeah, they still there. But like I said, it was not bad enough. I've actually heard people get waxes and they was like, I will never do that shit again. Yeah, I done set up my next 12. So I always say I'm not the type of person that like pain, but it really was not that bad unless I can handle more than I think I can handle. And then you don't have to worry about razor bumps. Yeah, because Nick actually told me that, um, Nick always tell me, like, you are so strong, you know, whatever. But I know that I do not like pain. So it wasn't, you know, after we got past that point, it was easy. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So we're about to go in this store, y'all. Let me see what I can get into. Yes, y'all. Carla really don't like shopping, so yeah. when I, I get in if the mood... If only y'all knew, I yeah. do not like shopping. So I'm actually going to try to help her. Sometimes I actually be coming through with help finding her stuff. Yeah. So... These are cute. Okay, so this is the type of style you want? Yeah, I think so. Okay, so I'm going to look for some. Let's we'll see if I see anything. They're cute, but... Oh, these are... No. You don't like this type of lace top? No, that's fine. <clears throat> the only thing that I'm not good at picking out, like Carla won't really let me get too involved, is her underwear. Yeah. Yeah, these the ones I picked out. <laughs> That's why. And I can, like, I can usually have a straight head, but when it comes to the underwear, Carla want to be comfortable, so she's gonna get, you know, these and these and these. But baby, I'm like, ooh, babe, what about these? But like, I, I need any scrunch <laughs> around my butt. We're gonna see what these gonna do, honey. They might be coming back to the store. <laughs> We're just going to go and put so, it out there. As far as the panties, I'm going to leave the panties alone. But the other stuff, I got you. Because uh-huh. my mind can't be straight when I think about the panties. One, two. One, two, three. Okay, that's five. You only get five? Well, yeah. It's a five for 30. Did you see these? These are cute. Yeah, I ch- those are ones I tried to pick out. But I couldn't find your size. I want this extra large probably too big, huh? All right, y'all. So I am getting ready to head. This is gonna be 21 minutes. Um, so I'm here at this massage place. It looks really fancy. Just dropped Carla off. Hold on. Let me work my way out of here first.
Okay. Oh, let's see. All right. So this is the place right here, y'all. It's called Terra May Salon and Spa. Uh -huh. So she's going to be here for a couple hours getting her massage and her facial. You know, it looks really beautiful in there. But I didn't even go in because now I got to go ahead, ahead and pick up her favorite um, cakes, which is from Nothing Bunt Cakes. And again, that's 23, 23 minutes out. But it should already be ready because y'all could already see I um, pre-ordered them. Um, but I also wanted to stop at a store to see if I can grab her up. Just a little something, something to make her feel even more special. Um, like flowers and um, just a few little knickknack, like small things. Carla's really big on the small things. Again, the whole acts of service and stuff. She just likes when she knows that you were listening to her. Um, and, you know, she's mentioned a few things that she may have needed. So I want to go to the store and try to just grab her up some stuff like that just to let her know that I listened to her and that um that I you know that I care enough to even do it so um let's get ready to take this drive y'all and then by the time we come back because we have not eaten yet and it is now 108 um but by the time she get done with her massage and stuff she's going to be ready to eat so then we're going to go to her favorite Mexican restaurant um Las Trojas um, get um, get her uh, favorite meal, the angel plate, and um, the uh, this big ass margarona drink that she loves. pick up an order uh, under Nick Rochelle. Huh? Is it a waiting order? Uh, I don't know what that is. Like, did you, did you call over the phone? Yeah, I called over the phone. Sorry. It was uh, but Buntinis. Buntinis? Yeah. Okay. So glad you found them. It. It was the uh, the three chocolate chocolate chip, three lemon, three coconut, and three red velvet. Yes. Oh, made me nervous. Yes, ma'am. They look good. Thank you. No problem. Have a great day. All right. You too. Hi. Can I get one of the peppermint chocolate chips? Oh yeah. I almost thought she couldn't find them. But here they are in the box. Y'all see them open later I don't want to uh, break the seal Woo! all right y'all what's up I got to hurry up and talk before I drive off but I got Carla stuff um I got a really nice little goodie bag here uh I think she's gonna be happy with the stuff I got I got her favorite drink that she just told me that she used to really love in the back of the day in the back of the in the back back in the day and then i got her some flowers and her her cakes so let me go ahead and try to hurry up and go get her i know she's she's not going to be expecting the bag but i still want to do something special for her um whew, okay let's go ahead and get on out of here guys because she should be getting ready to um be done with her appointment and I don't want her to have to sit and wait on me for too long y'all but I'm really happy with the things that I got for her it's some or small you know things that she's been talking about for a long time or she's whenever she talks about something you know I hear it and it's just though that's the type of shit she likes even down to the bag that I chose with the butterflies it's like everything that I got I tried to have like 
a good thought behind why I got it. Um, but the butterflies, anytime, like whenever me and Carla's hiking or walking or we're out in nature or we're meditating outside, um, anytime we see a butterfly, we, we get excited because we say, oh, shoot, a butterfly. Look at how high we're vibrating to see something so beautiful. Um, so when I saw the bag with all the butterflies, I was like, this is perfect. I didn't want to get a happy birthday bag or nothing like that. I wanted that butterfly bag. Um, I don't know if she's going to catch on to it or not, but, um, let's see here. I think I'm going to try to take this shit for, oh, fuck. All right, I got to get focused on this driving because it's a lot of traffic out here. Peace. y'all I made it just in time man I'm gonna be real with y'all I am exhausted like I was up late working and um I got up early this morning so I'm really actually really tired but ooh, I could just go to sleep right now take a little nap but um she sent a text she said she was just going in for her facial she had her massage and um uh yeah i'm really happy y'all they're nothing but cakes <laughs> her kitty bag her flowers her i even got a vase because i know we don't have a vase and um, Carla, she's not a big flower person, but if you get her flowers, she will really appreciate it. And she even like to put it in the vase and she like to look at it like sitting on the table. So it's like, she's not like, oh, I, I must have flowers, but she do like flowers. So um, I'm just ready to see her smile. And if her eyes water up, that's a bonus. Sometimes her eyes water up when you, when she see that you thought about her so my eyes trying to water up now uh i always get so emotional around stuff like this if y'all can i don't know if y'all remember like well y'all ain't gonna remember but for the people who actually went back to look at our old vlogs i had surprised her with something and like because she was so surprised her eyes watered up and then my eyes watered up y'all we some cry babies for real for each other with some crybabies. Whew. But I'm just going to chill and wait until she come back. Next time y'all see us, she will be in the car. And we'll be um, getting ready to show her, her gifts. We'll see how her experience was. In the cut? Yep, that's me in the cut, honey. Waiting okay. on you. I couldn't really tell. I was like, is this time? I ain't want to walk up here and walk to some stranger car. Yeah, I was uh, trying to take a nap, but I was like, man. Hey, I know, honey. I didn't realize it was going to take this long. Well, it don't matter. I hope you enjoyed yourself. I did. That's good. <laughs> <laughs> I saw the Instagram story. Oh, cool. Oh, shit. My bad. It looks so beautiful in there. Yeah, it was really nice. How you feeling, honey? I feel good. Feel relaxed? Let me see. You got the face you're doing on my face sweating. Wow. I got you some goodies, honey. You do? Mm -hmm. Aww. Aww. Thanks. Aww. So cute. Thank you. Yes, girl. And you got me a base and some birdie. Whoa. Whoa. This heavy. <laughs> Woo. Yeah. Oh, this little stuff look like it's right up my alley. Mm -hmm. This is cute. These some PJs? Yeah, PJs. Yes. 
Oh, these are cute. Yes. Oh. Still PJs. Yes. Girl, this is like an outfit. I can wear this. I knew you said why I said still PJs. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my favorite candy. For so real, <laughs> Roche. <laughs> what is this? Oh, my goodness. You remember you said the other ones hurt yes. your ears? Yes. Oh, and this for me to eat my ice cream right here. Yes. Look at my baby. She with the BS. Oh, this is so cute. Because you know I wanted a bracelet. With this, this is for your chakras. Yeah. Oh. Thank you. I said, I know my baby tired. You want to go take a nap first? Oh. <laughs> yeah, it's the waterworks. I'm so sensitive, y'all. Thank you, Booker. Can I blame it on my period? No. <laughs> Absolutely <laughs> not. Girl, this is like an outfit right here now. I think wow. I could... Girl, I think I could pull this off now. Those are pajamas. But you can do whatever you want to do with them. People be out in their pajamas. The way these little um, joggers and stuff look now, you can't tell. Ooh, and they feel so soft. Yes. And comfortable. Just how I like them. I'm ready to go eat. What about you? Yes, I'm ready to eat too. My stomach was growling. When I was getting my massage, girl, I said, ooh, child. She gonna be like this little lady hungry. <laughs> Margarona, do y'all have? Is it on here? Oh, uh, it's a different menu. You need a drink menu? Uh huh. Or just give me one second. Okay. I ain't gonna play. I um, thought you were. We already know what we want. Yeah. Unless you're getting something different. No, I'm trying to look top with our delicious cheese. The last time, did I get the chorizo? The, 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 um, uh -uh. I didn't either. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Strawberry. Strawberry. Okay. The large one. Large we're just going to share it. Come on here. Yeah, I'll come over there. And then we know we, we want to already. Um, I want, we want uh, the angel plate. So two angel plates with no um, chargizo, no sausage. No chorizo. Whatever it's called, yeah. On both? Yeah, on both. Thank you. Hey, you took a glass of water? Yep. Alright, thank you. You want salt in the ring? Oh, no. Sugar. Sugar? sugar. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> y'all, we was in the car crying, y'all. <laughs> we'll talk about it more later. Yes, because I don't want to cry right now. <laughs> Just crying, y'all. You know, if you cry before you eat, yeah, it's like I lose my appetite. You do? No, oh, well, I'm definitely not crying. All right, y'all, we're gonna go ahead and just enjoy ourselves. Y'all are gonna see a time lapse of all of this because I'm just gonna enjoy myself. All right, y'all.
All right, y'all. Angel plates are here. And this right here, y'all, the Magadona. This thing is huge. It's good. And it's strong. Taco Bell. <laughs> oh, my girl. <laughs> Baby, you're off. Oh, 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 Sostitos, Doritos, and Taco Bell. <laughs> spicy Doritos. <laughs> <It's> spicy Doritos. <laughs> Takis. <laughs> we need to live. Show. What time is start? Shit, seven. I mean, the fireworks start at seven. The gates open at five. We ain't trying to go in the gate, is we? No, I ain't trying to go in the gate. I don't even have a jacket on. Or a, I'm just. Um, I, I was just planning on just sitting. Yeah, I was gonna say or a head thing. So yeah. you know, I don't like to be cold like that. Yeah. So do you wanna um? You wanna go? Uh, I don't know. Chill in the parking think? lot. I'm down. Shit, the night is still young. Go ahead and make our way over there. How are you? That used to be the restaurant. Y'all, I'm tipsy. But I guess that's how you supposed to be on your mother your birthday. Yep. One time for the birthday beat. Hey! Hey! Two time for the birthday beat. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yes. Yeah, I'm good. I'm good to drive. Don't worry about me. I'm good. I'm Don't worry about it, sweetheart. Don't worry Don't about worry it. About this it. is that splat. <laughs> <laughs> that motherfucking splat. Hold on, sir. Let me go first. <laughs> but, um, so we decided we're going to go ahead and check out this fireworks show that they have going on in Huntsville. Like I said, Huntsville. Use the left two lanes to turn left onto US 72. East. Honey, she telling all our motherfucking business. <laughs> Huntsville has been popping, man. It's just they've been building so many restaurants all over the place. Real estate is going crazy. Just a lot of stuff that, um, and I'm glad to be here and just sitting still. So it gives me a chance, me and Carla, a chance to just kind of plant our roots and and just see what the fuck we want to get into, you know? Yeah. Business-wise. Oh, never mind. Go ahead, baby. Nothing. Go ahead, mamas. You about to cry. Yeah, I had a really good birthday. I wouldn't even say good. I'm going to actually say fantastic. And I'm trying not to cry. Like, Just let it out. Let's be vulnerable with our people. Uh, I can be vulnerable, but I feel like it's better if I'm not under the influence. But so no, that even I when can you truly wouldn't. no, so I can truly express myself. Yeah. You know? That's all y'all for say right this. now. I'll say this on my behalf. Like when I was just sitting down. I was, like, taking the time to read through all the comments. Because if y'all going to take the time to type those comments, yeah. some of y'all were even, like, 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 typing out, like, customized, personalized comments. Just showing your love to Carla, even towards just us as a, as a unit or whatever. And, um, and my eyes was watering up, you know? Yeah. Ugh. Y'all just made me feel so special. And I guess I'll go ahead and say it here because I know I'll end up saying it on the reaction channel. It's like 
what y'all don't understand is at one point in my life, uh, my eyes tearing up. I don't want to cry. So, um, yeah, like everybody, I think a lot of people get to that moment where they're like, what am I supposed to be doing in life? And um, I really struggled with that. I was just like, I don't know what I want to do, you know? And I never really just thought of, you know, the, the, some of the traumatic stuff that I've been through in life. And y'all don't even know to have. But I've never thought of me being a voice, you know, for other people. Or me finding my voice would make other people be like, you know, like, yes, bitch, like, pop your shit. So it's like, I just really appreciate y'all for, for just, you know, showing me the love that y'all showed me and, you know, being able to appreciate me because I actually worked at a job for 13 years and I never felt as appreciated as I feel since I've been on this platform. Damn. Uh, this shit is real. Yeah. Yeah, and I know me and Nick, we just left the restaurant. But I actually told Nick this morning, y'all, it was early this morning. Y'all know we haven't been able to sleep. But I actually was, like, tearing up this morning and telling Nick, like, I am so thankful for our, you know, our subscribers, the people that support us because y'all, I don't even, like, y'all don't even know, like, I have family members that I don't even talk to, you know, that don't support me, that don't know the person that I am. Y'all know more about me than my freaking mama know about me. And that's sad. It's like my mom, she she don't even have a relationship with my kids or anything. Y'all probably know more about my kids than my own damn mama know. That's how personal I am with y'all. Y'all know more probably about my life than my damn sister know. It's like y'all just, I've opened up so much on this platform. Like even about me going through my divorce and just the struggles I had. I haven't even been able to have those personal conversations like with my sister. It's like at one point, you know, I had to let her know how I felt. But I wasn't able to just share my story, how you all accepted me. I wasn't. I wasn't allowed that with my sister. My sister didn't accept me for who I was. So I just really appreciate y'all. Thank y'all so much for the love that y'all have shown me, for the blessings that y'all have blessed me with. Just loving me and Nick for who we are, y'all. And like, we're just going to continue to be who we are and just be our genuine self. We don't know any other way to do it. But just thank y'all so much. Even when I was talking to Nick early this morning, what time was it? It was like 6 this morning. Mm -hmm. And I told Nick, I was just like, how it started, I was having bad dreams. And I was like, I don't understand why I can't control my dreams because I know God got me. It's like I already know that I'm protected. And I don't understand why when I have bad dreams, there's put me in bad situations I don't realize it but I think me having the awareness is what will make me start to be more aware of it but that's just what triggered it when I was just talking about you know just the people that really support us on our channels so just thank y'all so much y'all just really don't understand it's like y'all are the reason that we're able to pop our shit on this channel how we pop our shit like we don't have it figured out y'all but we know what we want to do and the only thing we can do is be vulnerable enough to show y'all like this shit is possible <sighs> okay i'm about to go <laughs> Yeah, we made it out here to see the fireworks, y'all. Yeah. 
I told Carla I ain't seen the fireworks show in so long. Y'all, we have made it out here. Look at all these folks. There's a whole lot of people out here, yeah, trying to look at these fireworks. I told Nick I thought it was a charge, honey. Nick said, uh-uh, this free. Nick, this free. Is this pandemic fireworks? Uh-huh. This pandemic fireworks? I'm trying to think, do we want to get closer or you cool with this? Oh, this is cool. Because we should be able to see, like, when they go up in the sky. All right, y'all. So, we made it to this, uh, oh, do you want me to crack the window a little bit? You can crack the back ones. Oh, I'm going to crack them. Oh, do this one go down? Oh, there it is. You don't want yours cracked? No. All right. All right, y'all. So, here we are. Check it out. Yeah, <laughs> Are you getting out the car? You gonna stay in the whole time? I'm staying in probably. I ain't got no room for the damn nothing bun cake. But did you want to see them? Are you good? You probably good. If I see them, I'm gonna eat one. I'll probably eat one. Uh, what time is it? It's six ten. The fireworks show start at seven. I'll probably have some uh room for a, a bun cake <laughs> in like five minutes. <laughs> This is probably gonna be a nice long juicy vlog. Yes, y'all. This is Carlos Cakes right here, boy. Y'all yeah, know that's my favorite treat. Yes. My baby know right how to get me, boy. Mm -hmm. She know how to get me right. Wait a minute now. I should have just went on across there. I was trying to be right. cute with it. Yes. Yeah, they put tape on the side. This is not no motherfucking Christmas gift. What is happening? <laughs> Damn, you like bucket. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, why do I gotta go through all this? Damn, they done got tossed in this little car. Uh, yeah. Which one you gonna eat first? Honey. So the flavors again, y'all. Lemon, my favorite. I think this is supposed to be lemon. Chocolate, chocolate chip, lemon. Um, mm. uh, pecan praline. That's the pecan. And then uh, red velvet. And I think the red velvet got a little hints of little chocolate chips in it. Oh, this is sweet, sweet. It's, it's good? Mm-hmm. That's what's up. Is it moist? Mm-hmm. That's what's up, Mr. Lemon. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this is my favorite one. I think Sierra's favorite one is the pecan. If I am mistaken. This is better than getting a big old cake. Yeah. Yeah. Nothing but cakes, y'all. Mm. Carla is enjoying her birthday. That's what I'm saying. It be the simple shit, right? You be seeing all them YouTubers and shit doing the most. It's mm -hmm. like, I love that Carla don't, like, need the most. Like, yeah, I got to use my brain more <laughs> to, like, <laughs> make her smile and stuff. But I love that she loves the small things. Mm -hmm. Because no matter where we're at in life, it's like these small things are what will keep us grounded. Mm. <laughs> Just like I remember. I want one. I don't know which one I want, though. Maybe I'll try the pecan praline and see what, um, what it's giving. Little Sierra be a... I think that's the one she like. I think it might be. But... It could be another one, though. They're so moist. Yes. Honey. One bite? Oh, yeah. Mmm. That's good. Mm -mm. I'm full. <laughs> I am too. I don't even know why. I, I feel, feel like a real up. big year, big year. Hey. Hey. Please stop looking at us being big. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I 
What do the praline, the pecan praline taste like to you? It tastes like them pecan spins to me. We got some cinnamon in it? Mm-hmm. Because mm. um, that's what pecan spins taste like. Pecan what? Pecan spin. Mm. The little thing, remember I used to get them tasty cakes? And they used to be in that little swirl. Mm-hmm. All right. Oh, I know what you're talking about. Mm-hmm. By tasty, yeah. Mm-hmm. All right. Not me feeling like I got to pee. I know, me too. Shit. What are we going to do? Girl, if this was back in my young, drunken days, y'all, I would have found somewhere out here to pee. I remember one time I had did something so raunchy. I was, I was at a club in Birmingham with some friends. I want to eat another one. Go ahead, babe. It's your birthday. Which one? Um, Chocolate or red, red velvet. velvet? Red velvet. Well, I knew you was going to say that. But, um, um, I had to pee so bad, y'all. I went in the parking lot and squatted. But the thing is, I didn't think I, it's like, I didn't, we were on like a regular parking lot, like concrete. And it didn't, the two didn't cross on my head that if I pee, like usually I'm used to doing that and maybe going to some grass. But when I did it this time, it was on the sidewalk. It spread it all, it ran all the way down, like along, like, like a, hundred yards or some shit like that it just the pee was just running 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 down the uh the concrete and i actually had got embarrassed i was embarrassed but it <laughs> my friend peed but i was embarrassed because she was my ghetto friend and i was with my bougie friends oh shit and she was with <laughs> us and normally i don't let the two worlds collide but yeah. i did this day because it was homecoming for a and m this bitch asked us to stop. She done saw Allie ask us to stop. And she done went in the alley to pee. She, when she jumped out, she was like, bitch, I got to pee. And then here go one of my bougie friends. Well, do she have some tissue? I said, girl, probably not. She probably just going to shake it like a dog. Damn. Or at least uh, <laughs> the people I was with, they had napkins. They ain't give her no napkins. Surely your bougie people had napkins in their uh, glove compartment. No, because we don't piss in alleys. Well, That's still. for alley cats. <laughs> but at least she would have had some napkins for no. your hands. No, because we don't do stuff like that. We weren't even going to fast food places yet to collect napkins. Oh, they were bougie. Yes. And I was just like, oh, my God, I'm so fucking embarrassed. I was so embarrassed. I know they was like, Carla, what hood booger? You got us right. <laughs> <laughs> and is this something we need to know about you? Yeah, yeah, we finna see some fireworks. I'll probably get out when the fireworks start. Oh, man. Family Dollar. Is there anything else? Do Dollar General usually have a restroom? Yeah, you gonna buy some? I don't think no. they just let you come in there. Well, we still could call them and ask, hey, do y'all have a restroom? Because I gotta pee. Shit, y'all, we're gonna lose our little spot. I like this little spot, too. Shit. We can go to the Walmart. How far is Walmart from here? Let's see. Damn. I'm finna head to Walmart. No. Y'all, not call the time about. We're going to pee outside. Look, I told her, I said, honey, if there's some napkins in here, you could go over to the side. Uh -uh, sure you pee? might get locked up because the popos over there. So the popos will get you, girl. They don't play about that. Shit. They don't play about what? You peeing out? Hell no. Nah, Men do it all the time. Yeah, they do. I can go look. We could be right in this little corner. And, and they going to come the on over here and see what the hell yeah. you doing over here squatting this goddamn grass. <laughs> And you gonna see them Christmas lights on your ass. <laughs> <laughs> no, Christmas lights are at a king. No, they got Christmas lights. That's what I call them motherfucking police lights when they be lighting us up during the holiday. Shit. All right, well, we gotta go ahead and go to Walmart then. Fuck, I thought we was gonna be able to squat. Well, you and she don't wanna hover your uh, poom poom over no, no, no sex in the grass. <laughs> We only got we only got them thin paper towels that I <laughs> you get pee on your hand. hand. <laughs> Be it make me feel like I'm back in my old youngin days. Popping on the squat. 
wanna go knock on somebody down. Hell no, nah, girl. It's a <laughs> pandemic. That's the it's hood. a panorama. Look, that's the hood stuff. That's how it used to be like when we used to go to the classic back in Birmingham. So Dollar 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 Dollar. I don't know. We can go over there and see. Alright, let's see if they got one. I think they do have one, yeah. but Sometimes if you ain't shopping, they'll tell Girl, you. Girl, please, ass. what they gonna do? I'm they'll gonna tell you. No. As soon as I go in, I'm going right to the restroom. What is they gonna say? You gonna say what a restroom? No, I'm gonna go just walk in that bitch. I don't think it's like that where it's just out in the open. Oh, it's not. Subway should have one too. Oh, shouldn't see. Oh, that's CLS. Girl, I thought they said CVS. <sighs> oh my goodness, y'all! Dollar General did not have. A restroom. So now Carla's going into this Walgreens to see if they have one. I'm waiting on her to text me to let me know. Who I hope they got one, y'all, because I'm at a point where I'm going to start, like, doing the pee, -pee dance. <sighs> oh, shit. Oh, yes, y'all. She just texted me. She said they got one. Ugh. All right. I'm gone. I'm gone. I'm gone. Yeah. Oh y'all, look at the little kids sitting on top of the vehicle. I always used to want to do this. We could have brought our chair. We had our truck, our pickup truck. We would have had everything we needed. Wagons, chairs, uh, no um, blankets, umbrellas, no blankets. No skid this. <laughs> Okay, you ready? <laughs> that was so fun. It was. Yeah. I felt like a kid. Yeah, you look like one too. They knew it was a real one birthday. Hey. <laughs> <laughs>